What's going on guys? It's Nate from Nate Power Fitness here at Beautiful Sweat and Tonic in downtown TO. Here with my boy David DeKimchi. And we're gonna run you guys through an awesome 10 minute HIIT workout. All you're gonna need for this is a pair of boxing gloves. If you don't have a heavy bag, we're gonna use that too. Shadow box, we're gonna hit up a treadmill and a step. One minute on, hardcore work, 30 seconds, moderate. We're gonna move non-stop, like I said, for 10 minutes. It's an incredible 10 minute HIIT. Let's get it done. All right guys, walk up to the heavy bag. The heavy bag is first. Here's what's going on. Your first combination is a jab, jab, cross. If you're more advanced, you can throw any two, three, four punch combination. Jab, jab, cross, non-stop. So limited movement on the heavy bag. We're hitting that for one minute. Your between round combinations or your 30 second moderate piece, just going through easy reverse lunges. Non-stop, hands up. And we do that for two full sets. So that's one minute, 30. One minute, 30. Heavy bag is done. We're moving on to the step after that. All right, let's go. Heavy bag, one minute of jab, jab, cross. If you're more advanced, throw a two or three punch combination as hard as you can. In three, two, one, it's gonna happen fast. Go. Non-stop. Breathe, rip. This is a hit, 10 minutes. How much do you have in the tank? You're gonna wanna crush this one out, so don't hold back. It's gonna go by fast. Breathe, see your target. You don't want, do not wanna have more than one second pause between combos, so faster. Again, right away. That's it, right away, go. That's it, 30 seconds, that's what I want. See, flip the switch. Yep. Yep. And these aqua bags give you great feedback. They really do push you back a lot. Burn the shoulders out a little bit. 15 seconds. At this point, don't look at the screen. Just listen and rip. Five, four, three, two, one. Hands up right away. Reverse lunges, alternating. That's it, your knee almost touches the floor, but doesn't. Remember, this is a moderate piece for 30 seconds. Don't go crazy with it. Take your time. Get ready for set number two. 15 seconds. Again, here at Sweat and Tonic in downtown TO, we have, we're gonna have 16 aqua bags, so it's great to have access to these awesome, to this awesome studio. So no matter where you are and what you're doing, if you have a heavy bag, get it. If not, you're shadow boxing. One, one, two, go. Hit it, one minute. Actually, I want David to change it. Give me three punch combination. Go. Any three punches. Get it. Again. Non-stop. I'm gonna hold the bag. Let's go. Three punch combo. Faster. There you go. Come on. Dig in, guys. If you're shadow boxing, three punches. If you're shadow boxing, three punches. Non-stop. Punch faster than David. Come on. Non-stop. Hands up. 30 seconds. Come on, big man, dig in there. Yeah, nice hook. Nice hook. That's right, see, get it. 15 seconds. 10 seconds, guys. Outwork David. Can you do that? I think you can. Come on, you can do this. Let's go. Three, two, one. Reverse lunges. Fifteen seconds. After this, guys, you have a twenty-second rest. We're going to move directly over to your step. So make sure in your transition, you look at the screen. All right, crew. Here we go for your second portion. So look at the screen, and you're going to see here that David's going to sprawl on the step, and he's going to jump back on it, jump back off, and sprawl again. In other words, he's not touching his chest in a burpee to the bench. He's sprawling, jumping up, and going nonstop for one minute. It's gonna be difficult, but that's why you're here. 10 minutes, nonstop hit. And the 30 second moderate piece is just easy crossovers on the step, and then we jam it out for two sets. One minute hit, 30 seconds moderate. All right, let's go. Five, four, three, two, one, let's go. Boom, sprawl, kick, kick, faster. 
Too slow, Brother May. Come on. There you go. Guys, you're outworking David. You're outworking him. Get down. Get up. Get on there. Pop, pop, pop. Like that. So think of numbers. That always helps. So it's here. One, two, three, up. One, two, three, up. One, two, three, up. One, two, three, up. Keep that pace and it will all kick in. One, two. Come on, guys. Yeah. Heavy bag. Step. Treadmill. Serious. Five seconds. Then you move directly over into your crossovers. Three, two, one. Awesome crossovers. Again, moderate work here. 30 seconds, moderate work. Don't go crazy with this one. And even from here, you can hear David breathing hard, but that's how it should be, guys. You're putting in work, doing hits. So it's, as you know, it's nonstop, short breaks, constant work. When you're on the step, think constant tension as you're pushing through the step to cross it over. So he's changing position with his feet on top of the step. One foot's kind of kicking off the other. He's gonna switch in five, four, three, two, one. Let's go, last set. Kick it, pick numbers. One, two, three, up. Oh, I know he can do better than that. I know he can push faster. Come on, man, come on. Third workout of the day right here. Yes, tap, tap, up, off, tap, tap, up, off. Keep pushing, crew, keep pushing. Keep pushing, 30 seconds. 30 seconds, guys. Give me a little more speed, 3% more effort will get you there. Pick up that speed, shake it out and get it. 10, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, and good. Cross it over, 30 seconds. Moderate work. So right here, your quads are, should be shot. If they're not, next time you do this workout, make sure they are crushed by the time you get to this portion. Because if they're not now, you're just not going, likely you're not going hard enough. 10 seconds. We're going over to your treadmill and we're gonna finish strong with two one minute sprints and a 30 second jog. Three, Two, one, let's finish strong on one of these treadmills. All right guys, last station. Get on a treadmill. If you don't have a treadmill, grab a skipping rope. If you don't have a skipping rope, do burpees. I don't know, but get your conditioning portion in here. David is going to crush it out on this Techno Gym treadmill. It's all about you guys pushing at maximal effort. So we're gonna work at 10 to 11, maybe 12 miles an hour, and then he's just gonna jog in between. So one minute on, 30 seconds moderate, one minute on, 30 seconds moderate, and that's it. 10 minutes a hit. If you wanna do this bad boy again, you didn't do it hard enough the first time. All right, guys, come on. One minute, max energy in three, two, one, 10, 11, 12 miles an hour, whatever you want, let's go. Go, one minute from here. Not that much for me to say, you just get after it. And as many times as you do this workout, remember you always want to be able to push the limits a little bit more each time you go through the session. Ten seconds. Five, four, Three, two, don't jump off, jog. Again, it's difficult. Just jog here, okay? I don't want you to jump off. 
jog. You can jog at whatever speed you want. Again, heart rate once again is elevated, and this is your last hard piece. One minute, crushing out the treadmill. His first set was 10, his next set will be 11, and then an easy jog to finish off. I want him to jog at the end, because I want him to push a little more mentally, not so much physically at the end, all right? Get ready, five, four, three, two, one, hammer. Let's go, right there. Hear that? Come on, brother. Don't give up. Come on. Thirty seconds. Right to the end, guys. You gotta again, you gotta get in here a little bit. Fifteen seconds. Don't you dare stop, right? Just push right through to the end. Ten seconds. Straight through. Wait for it. Five, four, three, two, jog. Don't get off the treadmill, don't stop, jog 30 seconds from here. The jogging portion, even though you're done your session, is just to get in here a little bit, to kind of get inside your brain a little bit, because you're gonna to wanna to stop, but this is it. Just an active recovery for another 15 seconds, and the session is done. Five, four, three, two, one, hit that stop button. Guys, there's a great 10 minute hit that involves a heavy bag. If you don't have a heavy bag, shadow box. Using aerobic step. If you don't have an aerobic step, don't use a step, use the floor. Again, if you don't have a treadmill, do burpees or skipping. Use variations of stuff that you don't have, but if you can get to a place where you have access to all of these, this is an awesome workout to burn some fat, increase your endurance, and of course, get an awesome workout in as a burner or a finisher in just 10 minutes. Much respect to David, he always comes in here to train, and uh, I'll see you guys for the next workout. Make sure you check out Nate Bauer Elevated, it is now live, and of course, if you wanna come train with both of us, live and in person, make sure you come down and see us at Sweat and Tonic here in downtown Toronto. Good work, guys.